We've got some soft lifting for you, some sensitive thoughts, just to make you feel good. Isn't it rich? Are we a pair? Me here at last on the ground, you in midair. Ascending the clouds. Just a couple? It's the worst. It's worse. How are you doing, Dick? Oh, pretty good, asshole. Actually, the worst part of my mind is also. Oh! I guess that Radio Shack sale is just too much to pass up on. It's strange I ever meet people named Richard, they go, and call me Dick, and you go, no. And the wife, pussy, and the kids, sperm, and eggs. Try to find out what dick is a short version for rich. I looked at it. Rich is originally from the Latin, Rex, the king. It appears in every culture and every language has it. The Spanish, Ricardo, French, Richard, South African, every culture. Because what it means colloquially, what it means is the richest, the one with the most money, who in most societies is a bit of a dick. <laughs> as far as I got, really. It's strange though, because women name their privates after animals. Beaver, pussy, clam, camel toe. <laughs> men name their privates after other men. <laughs> hey Peter, I named my cock after you. <coughs> Thanks Woody. Where's Willie and Rod? <laughs> oh, Johnson's picking them up. They're at Wang's. <laughs> what about Helmet? He's not coming. <laughs> Very strange. I got in trouble with that joke in Kelowna. No word of a lie. Woman comes up to me after the show and goes, No, women do have that problem. Introduce me to her friend, Maureen Clit. <laughs> Spell with a K, but still. <laughs> Apparently, it's quite a common name. There's a lot of clits in the Okanagan. I did not know that. And she's okay, except her brother, who's a cop, Kelowna's Constable Clit, <laughs> which is still okay, except that he's about to be promoted to Inspector Clit, <laughs> which is always good advice. <laughs> you want to have a look. But the clits are sensitive. Oh, yeah, yeah. They don't like jokes about the name. They got a family motto you don't rub us clits the wrong way. <laughs> I wish I was lying. I live in Kitsilano. Not sure whether I should get a dog or a boob job. Maybe I should get a dog with a boob job. You know, six of them. <laughs> Put it in some Lululemon and send it on its way. You're looking good, girl. They make the dogs very small in Kitsilano. I was like, Kit's speech, I said, hey lady, can I use your phone? She goes, that's my dog. <laughs> hey, your dog's running away, that's a rat. <laughs> oh, cute. I've lived all over Vancouver. I lived in the West End where men are men and other men like it. <laughs> I lived on Commercial Drive where men are men and so are the women. <laughs> I lived downtown, the bottle pickers were amazing. I lived on the fourth floor, I'd drink a beer, I'd throw the can out the window, it wouldn't fucking land. <laughs> so I ate guys like bridesmaids after a bouquet in my alley. <laughs> Vancouver, great city. We got weird weather though, weird weather. We got floods, fires, drought. It's like a Jehovah's Witness wet dream out there. <laughs> Last summer, no water at all, big watering restrictions and but there's always a bright side, because I'm not proud of this, but I like to be outdoors. 
People get mad, they'll kick you off their yard and stuff, right? But not last summer. Last summer was, hey, get the willow. <laughs> Save my azaleas. Honey, get him a beer. <laughs> we got the Olympics coming to Vancouver. Winter Olympics, which is interesting because we don't really get winter. I'm sure we'll work something out. Oh, it's be beautiful with the snow. Snow? Shut up! <laughs> not now! The Koreans find out we're fucking dead. <laughs> I like our mayor, I just don't know what he stands for. <laughs> ah, it's a criminal joke! God! <laughs> you really think I'm running for fucking office up here? <laughs> love the Winter Olympics, so my favorite sport, women's hockey. I love that shit. I love women, I love hockey. It's like your peanut butter is in my chocolate, your chocolate is in my peanut butter. <laughs> <laughs> Remember the first female hockey player of any repute, man, no Rayon, the goaltender. She was beautiful. Two words, five hole. <laughs> it's a hockey term. It refers to the space between your legs. It's, a, it's very hard to defend. <laughs> Figure skating always fucks me up. They always do this, they always start with some camera. Way in the back of the ring, down the ice, some beautiful young woman skating around with her cute little skirt, flitting over her cute little butt, and then they zoom in and she's 13 years old. <laughs> Thanks for dragging the pedophile out of me. <laughs> <laughs> and that doubles, that's just sick. That whoa, 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 it's like extreme fisting or something. <laughs> <laughs> what, a little early for the fisting jokes? <laughs> I never know when. <laughs> Pretty good Olympic team this year, the Winter Olympics. Summer Olympics, just terrible. I think we tied Mongolia on the last fucking day. Fucking Mongolians. <laughs> Paralympics, we kicked ass. Holy shit, we got like 60 gold medals. We had some of the best gimps on the fucking planet. <laughs> Do you know what I attribute this to? Universal health care. What happened to the US Paralympic team? They died. <laughs> In a waiting room somewhere. Very sad. Tragic. <laughs>